Sorry, do you know what I need is the, um, the um, level? My name is uh, Stefan, Stefan Fedorowicz. I live here on Galliano Island. Great. I'm Jerry Pronto. I'm also co-owner here with uh, of Bluff Valley Farm with uh, Stefan. Co-owner? We're partners. We've been together <laughs> since 91. Wow, okay. Partners, yes. <laughs> Right. <laughs> Jerry was a teacher and I was a social worker. We both lived in the inner city and both dealt with inner city uh, issues with uh, our, our students and uh, the kids we worked with. It was very stressful for both of us. There came a time where we thought, you know what, if we, if we sold our house and moved to the country, we wouldn't need to, to be employed at these jobs that were stressing us out so much. And we didn't even put our place up for sale. We just told a few people in Manitoba and that place went. So we thought, okay, well then it was meant to be. So we ended up here. So we had a lot of work ahead of us to develop gardens and build our house. We've been working on it for the past seven years and try to do everything ourselves. The, um, the wood up from the siding actually came right off the property. There was, uh, when we got here, there was a tree laying down, well, a couple of trees laying down in front of the house that the wind had blown down and we had them milled up seven years, six years ago now, and, uh, and still trying to get to it. So that's what I'm doing today. Nice. A little bit of work. <laughs> Instead of producing income, which we do, uh, we like to simplify our lives first so that it, it, it doesn't cost as much to live. You have to be creative in order to live here, in order to make a living, because there's not people that will employ you, so you have to employ yourself. This is my garden. I guess there's a, right now it's sort of in between winter and summer uh, gardening, so I'm sort of switching over to my summer crops. So I'm getting that in, getting my garden ready. Most of our stuff that we produce and uh, we can usually sell here on the island. We don't have to go off the island at all because people tend to be interested in local local stuff. So it seems to be the trend <laughs> and the right thing to do, I think. You can go away now, okay? Sweetheart, I'm a friend of Jerry and Stefan's, and yesterday they so generously came out and helped me get away. Go on, with shearing. We ask people for help, and then they ask us for help, and it just goes back and forth. And you know, ideally, that's what a community is based on. Jerry and Stefan will need help with fencing. My partner and I will be here to help them out. We know all our neighbors. The support in a small community is amazing. Most of our friends in the city, they're making way more money than we are, yet we're, as a lot of people say, we're living like the million dollar lifestyle here. We have horses, we have everything. I don't miss the city. I don't miss it at all. You're happier, you're directly involved with your own food, and you all of a sudden you're much more aware, I think, of, of everything around you. Mm -hmm.